Love in difficult times. Gerald watched Elaine across the table as she carefully picked up her muffin and examined it. He looked at the clothes she was wearing and realized that her sweater was inside out. He usually made sure things like these didn't happen, but they seemed to happen more often lately. Their waitress, Maria, walked towards them holding a tray of milky, sweet tea, just the way Elaine liked it. A plate of delicious-looking butter cookies and a wide smile. How are you doing today? She asked brightly. Elaine flinched at the tone. Gerald looked warmingly at Maria. When one had dementia, there was no saying how the day would go. Maria took the hint, quietly placed the tray on the table, and walked away. Gerald offered Elaine the cup of tea, which she took with her hands, trembling. When are we going to get married? she asked. Gerald sighed. They had been married for the last forty years. Soon, my love, he said, placing his hand over hers. Elaine looked at his hand and then up at him and smiled. I love you, you know. You must talk to my father soon, she said happily. I love you too, my dear. I love you, Gerald said. After they had finished their tea and biscuits, they walked away slowly, holding hands. Love at first sight. Joseph didn't believe in love at first sight. He thought you had to know a person to fall in love with them. How could you fall in love with someone you had just met? But that was before he met Anna. It was raining cats and dogs that day. and Joseph had been drenched to the skin on the short walk from the taxi to the entrance of his office block. Anna was in a similar condition. As she ran to get out of the rain, they collided in the doorway. Her bag fell to the floor and its contents spilled out. Joseph immediately apologized and bent down to help her pick up her things. When he handed her the file and makeup bag, he looked up at her and felt his world shift. Her hair was the color of spun gold, and her eyes were blue. He had never seen a lady more beautiful than her. Joseph didn't know her name yet, but he knew she was the perfect woman for him. And thus beautiful journey of friendship and love started on a rainy day. Worthy love. One day, a husband brought home a bouquet of beautiful roses for his wife. The wife was pleasantly surprised and delighted. But before she could ask what they were for, their daughter piped up, What are they for, Daddy? He smiled and said, All my colleagues were discussing how tired they were of their marriage. It made me feel so lucky to have your mommy in my life. She is the most understanding and charming woman in the entire world. His wife beamed with joy, and they all came together in a family hug. It was a perfect moment. <laughs>